Yes. Dip. Yes. Pull. Yeah. Flash. Yeah. Indicators right. Right. Left. Left. Four way. Four way. Yes. Police. Yes. Blue. Yes. Twin. like this you see they were looking for two handsome and intelligent young men and when they found that they hadn't done any we were next in line so uh, here we are like you know whiskey echo eight to control 10 one at pontefract now on to the a1 whiskey echo eight over right? well, the main patrol there is the a1 which is 15 miles it's a very busy dangerous road quite a lot of accidents and we've got all the surrounding areas over as far as Wakefield. Whiskey Echo 8, yes, sir. Okay, can I be travelling down towards 506 Alpha? It appears the slow lane is blocked, sir. I'm going to start attacking on it. Whiskey Echo 8 to control, onto road accident, A1M, box 506 south of Wadder. Whiskey Echo 8, over. Sounds bloody rough, this guy, you know. speed if we're going to an incident obviously you've got to be really very observant we like to think that when we are driving fast we're driving safely uh, if we're driving at 80 mile an hour we like to think that we're driving as safe as a person uh, who's driving at 30 mile per hour uh, we've got to think of ourselves we've got to think of uh, other people and of course we've got to think of his image Get your jacket on, kid. Yep. Well, that's it, that's it. It's all the cars spinning round and round, and uh... you've no idea how it started spinning. You know, one car hit the other one, I think. Uh, one car moved, moved, seemed to move out. The car on the inside, I think. Yeah. And, you know which And then which? they were all. It all happened so quickly. You're all a bit vague about it all together. Yeah, it's a bit vague. Yeah. Can you spell your surname, please? S P E R K. S P E R K. Oh yeah, yeah. And what's your age, sir? Uh, age 53, sir. And you're the owner of that Viva? Uh, no, no, I was the passenger. Oh yeah, yeah. And I thought, well, that's going to be just just a little dent, and then suddenly everything sort of started happening. Yeah. Shalom. Car. Which was being driven by who? By a friend of mine. Yeah, yeah. Is this your friend here? Yeah. No, no, he's oh. taking an ambulance. Oh, is he doing it? Yeah. Ah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, he's got a year back. Ah, yeah. yeah. There he is. And, and you felt as though you were being pushed along you've the road? You've been pushed all the way yeah. down to... Yeah. ...into this bollard here. Yeah. Uh, uh, the car... Pushed into a crash. Crash, Maria. I went over yeah. into a field. Oh, we'll push right alongside you. Oh, yeah. And then, yeah, yeah. It then came to rest. Oh, 
What are you going to do then, Frank? I'm going to try and pick it up and take it straight out over here. Oh. But I'm a bit worried about doing more damage to it than what's been done, because although it looks badly damaged, you know... Echo 8 to control, we're on to Red House, vehicle check, really hit and run, fatal road accident at Walshford. Whiskey Echo 8, over. Whiskey Echo 8, this four. Now the idea is, watch your back, because of the danger down here. Check them, if they've seen anything, get their names and addresses and move them further down, then we'll check them fully, yeah, yeah. so that we're not causing any blockage of the traffic, all right? right so if you'll move further down the road and keep alive and uh, watch what's happening and I'll feed them into you, okay? Right, right sir. Right. right. Thank you, sir. accident on Tuesday between half past four and five, somewhere in this location. Would you happen to be on the road at that no, time? No, we no. Nobody out there, we're out Tuesday. Nobody at all. No. And Tuesday evening, about half past four to five o'clock, there was a fatal road accident on this stretch of road. They happen to be in the area at that time. Was it home there? I've seen it on the telly, I was at home. Yeah. I watched it uh, on the telly. Do you know if any of your vehicles were down this area? I don't know, I don't care, I couldn't tell you. No. There was, there was, there was, there was, there may have been a four-wheeler up here. Yeah, you've not heard any talk of an accident? No, not in our yard, no. 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 Okay, thank you. Okay. Miss Gecko 8 to control, we are resuming. No useful information received. Miss Gecko 8, over. You know you shouldn't go up there. Yeah, you know it's dangerous up there, don't you? Hey? What's your name, sir? What's your name? I don't know why. Yeah? I don't know, sir. I don't feel it. Well, you know, you shouldn't be up there, Tony. Mm. You could hurt yourself. It's private property. Mm. Hey? How old are you both? He's uh, 14 and 10. And what were you looking up there for? Probably something, right? Well, come on. Bit of adventure, eh? Hey? And I'll be down to see your parents. And don't have to see you there again. Right? Well, you know where you'll be, don't you? We are very fond of children. We have them uh, around the area playing with our youngster. I have one uh, child, a girl, Helen Claire Rushford. I've had various types of police houses in various districts and I find that some people can take you as a policeman or some people shun you. Um, but personally, I live my life and they live theirs and I'm quite happy. Wearing a uniform, I wouldn't say that it gives you a, a feeling of importance. At first, when I was young in service, you have a tendency to feel, well, everybody's looking at you. And it gets a bit unnerving, but after a while, you get used to it. My life is settled. I've been in the job six and a quarter years. She's aware of the fact that what we do 
You're thinking about him all the time, right? But if something did really happen, you know, somebody had let you know. Like, sometimes he'd probably be a couple of hours late from returning off his duty, like. Now, I, it doesn't worry me at all. I mean, you haven't to let it worry you, really. As far as my child's concerned, the way she plays sometimes uh, lets people know what the father does for a living. She calls me Bobby Daddy, but uh, she doesn't really know what a policeman is. If it did come to uh, me deciding on either the job or my marriage, uh, it would have to be my marriage because uh, I have a child. I can always find uh, a job with a pick and shovel or something like that. It's my family first. Quiet at the moment, Jerry. Isn't it? Yeah. All the wagon drivers on the way home for the holidays. Yeah. I think it could be busy if this weather holds out. Now the weather. All parts of the region will have fairly frequent squally showers today, perhaps heavy at times. There'll be a good deal of cloud, but some bright or sunny intervals are expected, especially east of the Pennines. Winds west to southwest, strong to gale force, perhaps reaching severe. People just look further ahead instead of just looking at the bonnet. It's obvious from the trees that there were high winds, but people just weren't taking notice. Let's get quite to control, over. Yes, sir, sir. Let's get quite to control. The wind signs are now erected at Fairburn. There are one at Selby Fork for the southbound traffic. One at Brotherton for the northbound traffic. We should get away, Dover. I think this is what makes driving worse, isn't it, when it's raining? All this spray from all of the... Yeah, these heavies, they don't dark kick some up, do they? You'd think it were hot, wouldn't you? But you wouldn't think it were back. Now cast a clout till May comes out. <laughs> Should have said all that. <laughs> you get worse. We don't obviously drive recklessly, but we're not supermen. If a policeman uh, has an accident whilst driving a police vehicle, if an offence has been committed, the policeman goes to court. If there's any suggestion that you are to blame, then you'll be suspended from driving immediately. I've known it be anything up to five months. During that time, you don't drive a police vehicle at all. You're better this time. It's only to run the wheel. drop though. Oh, just that bit short. Ah, short. Over to you. Over to you. I think if people take things too seriously, it can be dangerous. It can ruin a good policeman. It can worry if you let it. But I think the main thing is not to let the job get on top of it. I have tried to be conscientious about the job, but I think uh, the whole must come first. It's more difficult for me working full time. We 
seem to have weeks where we never have a meal together. And then other times it works out quite well. When uh, we first got married, every time he wasn't home uh, straight away, I was on the telephone asking where he was. But now I take it for granted that he can be anything up to two hours late. It's 5 to 1. Now the Northern News, read by Tom Heaney. Gales, heavy rain and low temperatures have made a gloomy start to the holiday weekend. But despite the weather, traffic is reported to be building up to most of the North resorts, although on the M6 it was well below. 1% of them will get killed and 10% uh, will get injured, maimed for life and, you know, they are bloody stupid, aren't they? <laughs> the main problem is that people will stick to the main routes. If they just get a map out, and see some of the back roads, they'll be there in half the time. They'd totally avoid jams. The jack is on. Yeah, Students all going home for the weekend. Peace, brother. I think at bank holidays everyone seems to be riding past you sympathising, thinking, look at that poor chap there, he's working. While we're sat in our car just thinking, look at those silly devils, we're getting paid for it. It's as simple as that. Now at home, the holiday weather and travel picture. And after the best part of a day of traffic jams and high winds, it's a little quieter on the roads tonight. With a full round-up, here's Ed Boyle. Most of the major hold-ups, like the monster 30-mile crawl on the A5 near Shrewsbury, have freed themselves by now. Whiskey Echo 8 to control, 10 to the Pontefract, traffic on the A1 now back to normal. Whiskey Echo 8, over. Whiskey Echo 8, 10 4. date of birth? The second of, of um, what's it called, it, 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 it. You don't sound too sure. Right. So where were you born? In Littleborough. Littleborough? You were going to get a bloody car. Oh, I bet you took one down with you, didn't you? Have you been to Bardney? Have you been to Bardney? No. Bloody pop festival. Complete car, Princess Toolkit is that. Piece of wire and a screwdriver. We're, we're, still, we're going in our thing now. Your intention, Your intention were there, wasn't it? Oh, yeah. You wanted to take a vehicle. It's, that's yeah. what it's the first thing you think of, you know? Yeah. Well, yeah, well we do. Because the first, the first you know? vehicle that, that goes missing between here and Halifax, you're the first to look up to. Yeah. You sound suspected of any that occur. Okay. On your way. Alan. On your way.
Whiskey Echo Age, Whiskey Echo Age, your location, over. Whiskey Echo Age to control, 10 one from the scene of the 10-9 at Starport Lane. For your information, one vehicle, two persons injured, uh, traffic reporting, Whiskey Echo Age, over. No answering, Whiskey Echo Age, yes. Uh, if you could chase the ambulance up, please. Whiskey Echo Eight, over. No, don't, don't press too hard because there's... Uh... Oh. <laughs> well, in that case, I'll not tell you what you're going to do. Thank you. Do you want a bit of TCP? Yes, Um, we have two small children, one's a baby and one's a little girl. Yeah. Uh, well, somebody's got them. Have yeah, the wife? Oh, the, 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 yeah, his wife's got right them. Yes, I think they are at the moment, but uh, if they could be looked at, you know, just until... Yeah, you, you were we in sort, the vehicle sort out. Well, I was in the vehicle, I was actually driving the vehicle. Yes. Um, what happened, if I can tell you now, so that you've got a, you know, straight off. Yeah. Funny enough, I just looked at my speedometer and I was doing exactly 30. The needle was exactly on 30. Yes. Something shot out from the side here. Whether it was a fox or a dog or what, I don't know. No. But it shot out straight across the path. I put on my brakes. Yes. Immediately. Uh -huh. And it's obviously skidded in, in doing so, veering across there. But I hit that. That looks as though it's rotten. I don't think it has yes. been hit, you know, not the impact well, of no, the thing. Um, that is as far as I can tell you, you know, what happened. Yes. Whiskey are going um, to control. We want another patrol car to protect the scene. It is on the bends. Also, the ambulance has not arrived yet, over. Yeah, we got in touch with the ambulance, the captain. Uh, we're scared to eat, uh, Daniel. How do you want it, Alan? Are you alright there? Yes. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Do you want to take it through, lads? Right. Um, no, I'm not. I'm just now. <laughs> nice. 
me. How are you fixed to going through? You want someone to come through? Mm -hmm. Ryan! Oh, wait. CGI! Holiday period, Jerry. Control to all cars on the A1, all cars on the A1. The zero message time is 1801. Cancelling the zero message time is 1218. <laughs> Bubble on. Bubble on. 